Hello and welcome back to another video on the channel everybody and today I'm gonna be breaking down a game that happened to me on on during weekend league I can't even speak English it's been that long since I've done a video I'm very sorry for that but this is gonna be a good game uh, this was game I think game 20 number 21 or game number 22 I don't quite remember uh, nevertheless this was an amazing game I want to show it to you guys very much. I was thinking a lot during that game. It was the first time that I was really in my bag again with my Ganban Trophies, which is the offense that I'm most comfortable in. Haven't ran it for a couple of weeks. It's last week and this week, I ran it. It's really good. Check out the ebook video I did on it. Really good stuff. Nevertheless, this was an amazing game. I was struggling a bit, but then sort of as the game went on, I got better. Um, it was sort of a mini comeback, I'd say. It was a really good game. Go check it out. Gonna break it down exactly what I was thinking in that during that game because I think that is important. It's important to explain what I'm thinking because it's it's always different. I can break it down in practice mode where it's nice and cozy. I can control everything, and then playing it in a game, it's it's a bit of a different vibe because you're playing against an opponent. Maybe they're not gonna do it, the exact thing that you're expecting, and you have to sort of adjust. And that's also a part of playing Madden and knowing your scheme. I want to help you with that today. Showing you how I adjust during the game. Obviously. And give you a little bit of a view into my mind. I'm kicking the ball off first. That is very big. In your settings. Uh, at the main menu. Make sure to have your first coin toss option at kick. Kick with the foot. Just to make sure that you have a chance of getting an extra possession. Because say the game was like this. Every person gets two possessions in the first half, both of them. Then the person that gets the ball in the second half first has now all of a sudden has an advantage. He has three possessions, the other one has two. It's not going to happen that, that like that all the time, obviously, because it's unpredictable. But just give yourself a chance. He's coming out on strong pro, running the ball. Lucky Shed, um, number 83, Ted Hendricks, he made an absolute dog play right there. Thankfully he made it because I don't know I, I, it didn't it didn't look like I had that great of defense he shed it thankfully stopped the run in the backfield Barry is deactivated that's already a good thing I'm expecting him to give me the Oakland tour at some point he's gonna get into I'd say or I my guess is that at some point he's gonna start to run for example gun trips at end which is very good as a good inside zone I wanted to be ready for that and set up my big Nick Lowry for that he's coming out of single back ace right here. I'm thinking he's gonna pass right here, and that is gonna prove a mistake. You see how he gets a first down right there. Who runs the ball in second and 12? Uh, 13. Runners in man 20. It's, it's bad. It's bad. I didn't expect the run there. He ran the ball. Got the first down. Now I'm gonna be ready for this because I know, okay, I can shut his run down. He's not gonna get away from it. That's good to know. He has Randy Moss right here, and he runs the ball. He, who runs the ball with Randy Moss? He loses five yards again. At this point, I'm thinking, okay, this guy's a moron. This guy, he doesn't know what he's doing. Why would you run the ball when you have Randy Moss? Anyways, comes out of the single back ace. I don't remember what happened last time. Not going to let that happen again right here. Woo! Going to stop the run. What was that sound effect? <clears throat> My bad. Anyways, third and 11 stopped it for a four-yard game. That's a game that's not the best run defense, but he at least still has to be careful. 3rd and 11, that's a tough down to get. That's really tough to get. 3rd and 11, I, I'm going to send everybody. I'm going to use a rush. That's all I know. Near close flex, really good. You have to use a rush it. Get in there. <clears throat> get the sack. Very beautiful. 4th and 19 right here. I don't know why he's hurrying up. He should just punt the ball. If I were him, I would have just punted the ball. Seen, or at least just to check. Uh, what I can do on defense. I don't know why I didn't use a rush him. That was very dumb of me What are you gonna do what are you going to do at that point? Unfortunate I'd say at least um, But I'm not really too mad about it. I mean, I'm Don't get me wrong. I'm terribly mad at it about it, but He hasn't gotten anything going on offense really this has been his only positive play I mean, he had one run for 12 yards, but that's the that's the only reason he scored. Fourth and 19, I stopped every run. I stopped every every pass. <laughs> uh, I stopped the one pass that he threw it to that point, and then right there, that's just bullshit. 
can't do anything about that just gotta move forward 7-0 he's in front right now that's obviously very frustrating uh considering how well defensive drive i had that time he gets a touchdown what are you gonna do gonna go into my beloved gun bunch and people people have to start to send heat at me i don't know why they think that's a good strategy i start to dot them up and they still send heat I'm hoping he sends heat to be honest because I can deal with that. I can deal with that really well. He's coming out in 3 4 odd. Come on. Like, come on. C can you make it any easier for me? I mean, that right there was not the greatest beat. I had the crossing out open and maybe even the post. Let's just not forget about that. I don't have Randy Moss in right now. I haven't used up the Moss. I want to break it out in a very important moment. I want to break it out when I have the bunch to the left side. Uh, right there. Yeah, I had the I had the post, could have thrown it. Did not want to risk it though. Uh, talking about Moss, I want him to be in when I have the when the white side is to the left. So I have the solo wide receiver on the right. Now he's on a streak. You see that third and thirteen. That's the perfect situation for me to use it. He's gonna send everybody. I I already know that. Just gonna wait, and I apparently didn't wait long enough because he didn't get the egg that I wanted him to get. I'm gonna pass the ball still. Fourth and thirteen. I feel like I can. I feel like I can move the ball on. I, I just. I don't know why. I just had the feeling that I can move the ball on. I'm gonna run two post routes. I already know that because I just played that game. <coughs> gonna do two post routes and see whichever one he's open. He drops into coverage. <laughs> For some reason, he drops into coverage. That is such a dumb call. Literally, that's the worst thing he could have done. He gives me the post route that was so easy to convert. In that case, third, fourth and 13, don't even give me the chance to get the time for a post route. That's the only thing that I could throw realistically. Either a corner or a post route, these routes take time to develop. Don't give me that time. Send seven, maybe even send eight. I don't know, send eight if you want to. Send the cornerback, press all DBs, send the cornerback that's closest to the bunch side. Blitz that guy. Don't give me time. Double post routes, one of them is going to be open. I, I just know that. Um... Bad call by me. Um, not bad call, just bad execution. I, the poster was wide open, obviously. I saw it. I just wasn't... I just got happy feet in the pocket. That was very dumb by me. Um, what you gonna do? Gotta get that, that just made it worse. In the air. Um, I need to get to a bobber. ASAP. Actually, I don't know. I, I feel like I, I like the long hair. Off topic, get sacked, second and 21. That's the worst thing you can do against a player like that. Because that's what that's what he wants. He wants to sack me. Well, pause. <laughs> pause. He wants to get me in tough uh, situations. Right there, bad play by me. Good pick by him. Good defense in general, right there. My mistake. He gets a pick. He gets the ball. I, <laughs> bad by me. That sack really ruined that drive for me. Anyways, I know that I'm gonna stop him. I know that. It's not even a feeling. I know that I'm gonna stop him. Anything was everything was back besides besides that um, long post Come on. Are you kidding me? Barry Sanders doesn't even get the great animation. Come on Come on, man. That's that's very that's super unfortunate. You know, you see I'm still smiling because Spoiler alert, I won that game. It's not a genius to stop that. He got two incredibly lucky plays the second one was sort of my bad because I clicked off too late and at that point he was already past me and then I didn't take the best angle with Deion Sanders so that was sort of on me but I know that I cannot I can minimize that and besides that he has not he has not any big any good plays he had two big plays the one cheats are uh, where Randy Moss got behind everybody and that bad play by me to be fair so I said he hasn't gotten anything going. I'm not worried at all, to be honest. Sounds very cocky. I'm very, I'm very self-confident person. Um, he's, he's not gonna move the ball on me. I just gotta find a way to not beat myself right here. That's the biggest thing. Just make sure, block everybody, get the time you need, and throw a pick because uh, you forget to let go of R2. Come on. I say, I know I say come on a lot, but that, that, that's really frustrating because I had him wide open and I just forgot to let go of R2. What you gonna do? It's gonna happen sometimes. He's coming out on iPhone Pro because you know that he's not good at anything but pressing A 
and then swerving around with a human joystick running back. God damn you! Come on, give me the fumble. I don't want the fumble right there, really bad. Nevertheless, stop him. One yard gain. Perfect. Second and nine right now, single back ace. I remember. He's gonna run the ball. He's definitely gonna run the ball. That's just that's just something that I know. I'm not gonna risk anything. Runs the ball, predictably. Get stuffed. But he's already in field goal range. 38 yard line. He's gonna run the ball a third time. Already know that. You don't have it. You don't have you don't have to be a genius to know that he's gonna run the ball. Gonna run the ball one final time. And make sure to kick his three and go up. Three possessions. Three possession lead. That's horrible. That's bad. That's very tough to come back uh, come back from. Um, we shed with Ted Hendricks. I thought that that was enough. But three yards. Kickers at this point in the year are so good. 58 yarder. Even though it says that he can make it. He, he's going to make it. Um, I was frustrated. Because that inaccurate quick throw. That is... That is a really dumb mistake that I usually don't make. Or I hope to not make it. I still make it sometimes because I'm used to dashing that uh, it's going to happen. Okay. What are you going to do? Can't complain about it. I can't be a bitch and c keep complaining about it. I just got to keep fighting. That's what I tell myself. I have had a lot of comeback vic victories this weekend. Because I just keep fighting. I know that I'm better than him. I just can't. I just can't get out of my... Uh, can't lose my mind i just gotta stay focused and put one drive together then he's gonna make a mistake i know that i can force him, this guy to either make a mistake or not get anything running the ball i know that right there he's, he keeps sending everybody i i can't dot that up okay I, i'm not scared by a blitz everybody you have to be a really good player to blitz everybody i'm not saying that nobody can stop me blitzing everybody but this guy can't he's not good enough um, playmaker up, don't really have anything, just gotta be smart, gonna throw it to Calvin Johnson, he gets absolutely licked, come on, he got, he got destroyed, got two yards, thankfully the two minute warning was right there, because, so he can rest, that was a big hit, <laughs> that was a really big hit, um, second and eight now, he still keeps sending everybody, I can, throw it right at him, right at him, very bad, very bad of me. I'm not happy with that read third and eight now after that dumb play by me. I'm not sure if he's gonna send everybody or whether he's gonna drop in coverage. I'm just gonna expect him to send everybody and he drops in coverage. What, what the hell is he doing? He, the post route is open again. Great animation. Not gonna take it. Not risking taking a hit from. I think that was running a lot. My, I didn't see it properly. Anyways, did not want to take a hit. That would have been very, very stupid of me. First and 10, 37 yard line. I have a chance. Voice crack. <coughs> I have a chance. First and 10, gonna put the hitch back out there. Gonna make him bait me. The tight end went out on his fade immediately for some reason. I, don't ask me why he did that. That was a very dumb decision. Somebody came in free. But I saw that thankfully and got the ball off. Second and one now. Perfect spot. I could have could run the ball, but I'm not gonna do it because I don't want to. I don't want to risk that. He has a very good user on that play. He could realistically pick both posts. With the spot that he chose, he could have picked both posts. Posts. I can't throw any of them. I just gotta take the sack. Still in field goal range, thankfully. Right there, I felt like he was gonna. Can I get sticky? I can't get sticky. Oh my gosh! I I, I mean, I sort of remember that, but I didn't remember, didn't remember that it being that sticky. That <laughs> whoop. Um, that's grab and go for you. Anyways, all on the three yard line. I'm going to run the ball now. Um, I sort of felt like he was gonna bait back to the hitch because I had thrown that a couple of times at this point. I just waited for the moment. Perfectly chose it. Got a little bit sticky. And now we have a chance for a touchdown. Don't get in right there. And I'm going to hurry up. I don't want him to take a timeout. Because I don't want to give him any time. He's going to run the ball. He could realistically pop off a run any time. Don't want to give him an, uh, many chances. Going to take it all the way down. I hurried up so that he wasn't going to take a timeout. Um, second and goal at the one. I feel like I'm in at this point. <sighs> Yeah, waiting, taking it all the way down. That's pretty sweaty. That's pretty try hard. That's what I am. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm sweaty. I'm trying hard. 
Yeah, I'm sweaty. Let's just put it at that. Um, no pause because that is actually how I am. Um, usually when it's hot outside, I just have to move for like two minutes walk and then I'm sweating. Um, third and goal. Going in. I don't know where I was going with that sweaty thing. Anyways, get the touchdown. Very beautiful. Now I'm only down 10 points. 25 seconds. He's not going to pop off anything. I already know that because he hasn't popped off anything besides that one run. And I know that I'm not going to make that same mistake again. Like, that's just not something that I'm going to make. Going to kick the ball off to him. Three miles uh, an hour against me. So I know that he's going to. That uh, Deion Sanders is not going to touch this football. Uh, Mel Renfro is going to return it. 25 seconds. I think that's about. Boom. Porter. Perfect, 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 perfect. I'm back in the game. Um, I was about to say, I kind of juked right there. But I was about to say, 25 seconds, that's about, let's say that's five runs. Five runs. If he gets out of bounds, five runs. If not, then maybe only four. I can stop five runs for no game. I definitely can do that. I'm not going to give up a touchdown. I knew that. That was really dumb of him to take that. He still can take that chance of fumbling. It's Taylor Mays. He's he's got enforced. He's running directly as you come on. Give me a second fumble. Um, why do you juke that? That was so dumb of him. I th I feel like I got cheated there, because what does Taylor Mays do? He destroys ball carriers. He has enforcer. Mel Renfro, somebody who's not good, doesn't have good carrying. Who doesn't juke? Doesn't have good juking. He jukes and he gets absolutely destroyed by a Taylor Mays and we don't get the ball out. That's a cheat. That's a cheat and a half, bro. Anyways, talking about a half, I'm gonna not, I'm trying to not give give up points before the end of this half. I'm gonna use a rush with Ryan GZ because that's what I do. Um get picked up, unfortunately. He gets sacked though, doesn't get a chance to egg me. Thankfully, I felt like that was gonna happen. I don't know why. Just seen, seen that way. Seen that way. That egg um, for the first touchdown, that was crazy. I didn't even rage at that point. I was just like, I don't know how to say it. Um, I was just in general. I was just, I couldn't believe it. I was basically um, just quiet. I was stunned. I, I didn't say anything. I was so frustrated. And to now be back at, at a spot where I'm only down three points. And I'm about to go into half. That's ideal. Um, that is that is very much ideal. One more time, I'm gonna face Gun Bunch. I'm gonna send everybody at him because that's what I do. Um, even gonna send Taylor Mays. Gonna send eight people because I don't want to give him no chance, not a single chance to get off anything positive. Use the rush. Miss him a little bit. Throws it up, doesn't doesn't catch it. Thankfully, he doesn't catch it. <laughs> but fourth and fourteen, not the twenty-two. He's gonna try it one more time, obviously, because there's a very small chance or a very slim chance, and the play is gonna only, is only gonna take one second, and that I can get a field goal. So I don't mind this play by him. I still think it's a little bit risky with how everything has been working out. Cam Newton can get strip sacked. Um. Burn, same stadium. Um, already had that experience. He throws it up, doesn't come down with it. That's the end of the first half. And I think that I'm getting the ball. Am I? Let's see. Ah, yeah. Okay, perfect. I am going to get the ball. Only down three points now. I think that I'm winning this game. At this point, I'm very confident that I'm going to win this game. He had one lucky, one lucky ass catch from Andy Moss. He had one big one play touchdown run besides that he hasn't got anything to work and he got three points because i made a stupid mistake i overthrew somebody which is my fault uh who was wide open so really not scared at all gonna do the same setup gonna force him gonna force him to use the hitch yeah <laughs> he's he's so bad i almost got hit stick right there and i felt like if i got hit stick what I feel like if I got hit sick there, that would have been a fumble. Don't fumble the ball, thankfully. I'm still. I'm, he can't stop it. I'm not gonna stop doing it. That, that's that's my rule of thumb. If he, if he can't stop it, then why would I do anything differently? Why would I do anything differently? He this time I think he had 
What did he have? He had a bird hook by his linebacker out there to cover the hitch. That, but he he bit out or he bit down on that drag so hard. Uh, yeah, easy. Not 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 a tough throw. Um, that I had the post wide open. I'm just moving the ball him, and he just keeps blitzing. I don't know why he keeps blitzing. That's at this point you should realize. Okay, I gotta play coverage against this guy because I'm not gonna get home with the blitz anymore. He knows how to beat me. I don't know how to stop it. Let's try something else. I I respect people that hold on to their game plan, game plan, and do their best to adjust. With, but with the same plan, but nothing he's tried is working. Nothing, nothing. Drag route wide open. It's not working, dude. Change up. If I were you at this point, or if I were if I was him, obviously change. Do something else. Go in big nickel, uh, not big nickel. Go get go, get in big down one for six, and see if I can stop that. Okay, <laughs> but that's. I mean, obviously now he drops the coverage. It's, it's I can I can also scam. I I can speak. I mean, I can scam, but I can't speak. Very dumb of him. I don't understand him. He he's he's not supposed to be in this game with me at all. Like he can't. I'm out thinking him. I'm out thinking him every step of the way, and I just he just got two really lucky plays. Bo Jackson is the end zone. Finally, the score says what I think it should be saying. Finally, finally, I'm gonna kick the PAT. I'm up four points, and now he has to get something going. He hasn't gotten anything going on going on offense. One lucky play. I'm gonna keep. I I sound like um, you know church every time the amen. I'm repeating the amen. One lucky catch for a touchdown. One lucky run. One overthrow. These are those are his points. <laughs> best of, best of luck moving the ball on me with now that I'm not gonna get that that uh, that big pass play is not never gonna happen again. In let's say this that big pass play is never gonna happen to me again this year. Next year, yeah, it's gonna happen sometimes. Good good on him to lay down. Uh, that run, I'm not gonna give him that anymore. And also now, I'm not gonna throw him a pick because I can't. I don't have the ball. He's in a bag. I already know that. Just stay disciplined. Be disciplined with you. So don't attack the line of scrimmage too hard. Uh, and just be smart. Be smart. I have my um, deep quarters out there so they don't get burned. <laughs> and he tries to burn my deep quarter. He throws it up. He can't do anything. He can't do anything. I have that. So I have that box so hard. I mean, <laughs> it's a box. It's 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 such a box. Second and ten. Gonna. I'm expecting him to do the same thing, but I'm still spying my safety, obviously because I don't want Cam Newton to roll out and buy some time. I also. Okay, he had the post. Uh, not bad. Not bad. Not bad. I think I would have been there. Um, but I also don't want him to pop off a run. I still want the safeties to be in the run fit. Third and 19, now he has no chance of keep, of converting. Um, I'm playing coverage right here because I know that he's going to play cover. He's going to um, not run the ball here. And Ian Sanders gets the older Beckham animation. And we get the stop that we needed. And the game is over. Whew, thankfully. It took quite some time. This guy, he shouldn't have, he, he shouldn't have been in the game in the first place. Very lucky by him to get those points. And then I clutched up. I said to myself, okay, it's stop complaining, you need to win this game. Oops. Um, I did. It was a good game. Shout out to my opponent GG's. Even though I said he was bad, he still fought. He still tried his best and that's it. That's what matters at the end of the day. Now, 17 and 3 right here. I didn't finish with I didn't finish with an amazing record. I'm not too happy. It's not horrible. I'm not too happy though. Anyways, that's it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then obviously hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate you guys for everything that you've done. Keep being awesome. Got a lot of good reviews on my video edits that I did for Chaos and Gut Fox. Appreciate you guys for that. Um, if you want to see some more heavily edited videos like I did for these YouTubers, Chaos Gut Fox, go check them out. Um, let me know in the comments. That's it for today. Subscribe, like, comment. See you tomorrow. Because I'm actually going to do a video tomorrow.